right guys rolling down to the water in some heavy rain it's gonna rain all day be some thunderstorms this afternoon two to three inches of rain uh, when we get that much rain across our river basin that uh, equates to a two to three foot increase in water levels uh, they have pulled the lake down a bunch two feet in the past 48 hours so it's gonna be interesting uh, just how low the water is at the boat ramp should still be able to get in fine but uh, they pulled it down a lot ahead of this rain There's remnants of a hurricane uh, that came in through the gulf one of many this year it's coming up through here dumping a pile of rain so uh, i'm not sure if that big drop in the water is going to affect the catfish bite or not or if we're going to have enough inflow that is uh, starting to spike a bite but either way we're going out in the rain putting some baits in the water there's a look around the ramp guys there ain't nobody here i'm the only idiot that's gonna be out here fishing today but listen you fish when you can uh, fish when you can try to put them in the boat i don't get to pick my days so if it's raining i got a raincoat all right guys here we go it's raining it's not heavy yet but uh it's coming lake is down a long way up not at the end of the ramp but uh it's close <clears throat> Yeah, normally water levels back up here, but it's way on down, way on down. It's the end of the ramp marker. The good news is she's probably gonna be filling up fast today. It's raining, boys. It's raining. Right, guys we'll try to keep the lens as clear as possible we got us a meter went to drifting main river channel deeper water about 35 feet fish are scattered looks like they're suspended about three feet off the bottom i'm just keeping my bait down there in the dragon zone with the cmt rigs this one came on a piece of perch i've still got the chicken out but this one hit a piece of perch this is on the perch side of the boat happy to get hit they're moving water still it's pouring rain now so i apologize for any rain covered lenses and rain noise Right, right right on my drift side. Got a pretty good bit of current coming down through here. Decent fish. conditions I'm happy to have one simmer, simmer, simmer. Man, it's got some mud on them I got a feeling they may be a little inactive That's fish nice blue about 13 pounds back in all right guys got another one going on pinky this one's on chicken just got that other bait out. Let's see if I can get this around some stuff here. There we go. Yeah, I just got the other bait back out. And Pinky got slammed. Let's see what we got here. This feels a little bigger. I've got a perch rod in the water trying to pick off some bait. I'm trying to finagle it out of the water. Pouring down rain. It's uh, we're in the middle of it now leading edge of it apparently it's gonna rain for several more hours thunderstorms tonight the interesting thing is though i can see the back end of it on radar so winch your wiper on that one hopefully y'all can see like i said i apologize for the rain but it is what it is i'm gonna fish when i can y'all know that 
some fish right now. There's no lightning yet, knock on wood. I got wooden seat. That's the only thing I got wood I got on this boat. Oh, that's another good fish. Another good fish. That one's a little bigger like I thought. Two in the teens. Definitely something different down here in the middle of the lake. Yeah, and that one's on chicken. Bigger fish. Not a monster, but mid teens, about 16 pounds. Good and healthy. Still nice and warm. Don't mind this water. The water's still about 80 degrees. Come back alive. Boom. That's two. I'm happy. Now in case y'all hadn't seen it before, what I'm doing is just using Santee drift rigs. Got a circle hook, peg float to suspend it, and then this drifting sinker. If you hadn't seen this before, there it is, guys. Strawberry Jello chicken basically i'm taking chicken breast and soaking it in strawberry flavor jello i kid you not and there goes another rod right there guys look at that look at that green one going i'm gonna chuck this bait in the water and get that one that one is going right there he is taking off to the side see it boom hooked up hooked up and that one is on chicken too. Everything on the port side of the boat is chicken. Everything on the starboard side is perch. I got some kind of magic going on right here. Not sure what it is, but that's three fish. Kind of quick. I don't know how big this one is. He is not. I don't even know if he knows he's hooked yet. Doing a little rod dance there. I'll work this one down. A little deeper water, bring it up slowly. He's already up though. He's a good fish. He's not as big as the other ones. I don't know. He may be. Another good This one looked like about the like the first one. I'm damn digging. Ooh. Yeah, you can hook out of you. Get another piece of chicken. Another one right at 13 pounds. I see. A little more feisty. Look at that. Hey world. Back to back, two on chicken, guys. Kinky, small fish on a piece of chicken. We've been dragging for a long time since that last flurry of fish, and uh, covered a lot of water. Got back here to the river channel. This is where I got bit. So. Maybe this is where the fish are in the deepest part. We'll see. And we'll keep covering some water. We're almost out of this rain. Kind of coming into what would be the eye. Not really an eye, but it's the center of the low pressure associated with this. So hopefully dive down past it. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Nurse him up here. Not a big fish. Damn. 
Channel Cam. Channel Cam. In the boat. Out here in the deep water too. Timmer. Yeah, I knew you had a shake in you. I knew you had another shake to go. Timmer. There we go. Some deep water there. Just a channel. Yeah, this has been a pretty long pull through here. Uh, you know, the first bite's a pretty good while since a little flurry of three fish. Not sure what's up. Come on, uh, wind's picking up. Uh, rain's starting to die. Wind's picking up. I'm going to try to uh, stay this channel. Uh, kind of makes a big bend up here. And if I can get to there, just let the wind carry me. We're just going to drift and see what happens. I'm marking fish. Fish are on the sonar. Fish are in the water. They're in the deeper part here. Uh, but it's not on fire as far as the bike goes. So. Right, man, the fish latch down here. Hey, yeah, it feels like a small fish. Rain's starting to let up, wind's starting to pick up. And uh, trying to clear this point. Using a little bit of a graduate level drifting tactics here. I got current one way, wind another, and I need to clear the point in another direction. So I'm having to do a little finagling to get around the controlling motor. Once I do, it's clear sailing. Should be able to cover a lot of water. 100 feet up channel cat, boom, he popped off. Right there at the edge. Uh, that was on chicken. Uh, if you hadn't figured out which side the boat is on. That's five fish, four of them have come on chicken. Two of them good blues, two of them channels, so kind of is what it is. But yeah, the uh, rain is finally starting to die. So uh, hopefully get a little good fishing in here and uh, get a couple more we'll see what happens we've got a lot of open water once i clear this point here so maybe we'll make some magic got us one of eating on the purse side boom oh my god hooked up back on the perch this is a decent fish we made our turn out there we got going in a good direction here it's coming across the area I seen one big arch, and that was it. I hadn't seen anything else. Actually, it was getting ready to reset, and then just kind of said, you know what? Let's just drift it. And got a hook up. Good blue. Might be one of the bigger fish today. Simmer down, simmer down, simmer, 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 simmer. Come here, big boy. Gotcha. We are on a 13 pound roll today. Feisty fish, too, up my dad. That's our thing. First blue in a while. We'll take it. Happy to have it. Boom! On a perch. That's number. Let's look at my numbers and see. But that's only second one. We even got the evidence here. He's on a fillet. Big old fillet. Guys, I can't make this up. That's uh, out of six fish, four of them came on that chicken, and uh, only two on the fresh cut white perch. So. Kind of is what it is. Uh, that stuff's hard to beat right now for some reason. I'm not sure what it is that's working for it, why they're hitting it the way they are. And you saw a couple of decent fish hit it. So, uh, yeah, I'm not sure exactly what that is, but it is what it is. So that's it for now. I'm going to take it to the house. Well, folks, if you made it this far, thank you for watching. Here are a couple more videos that I think you're going to like. I'd watch that one and then that one. No. No, do, do that one first and then that one. I, I don't know. Just watch them both. They're both good.